Hey YouTube, so as you can see, I am going to attempt to make a maxi skirt. Well, you don't know that, but I have some fabric here, and it's striped fabric, and the stretch is going horizontally, and I believe the salvage edge is here. I'm learning, guys. Self-taught, so, and watching on YouTube. So what I want to do is, I have a maxi skirt that I like already. And I'm going to use this as a pattern. This maxi skirt has slits on both sides. And I love the way this fits me. So I'm wondering if I want to put slits on these two. But I'm not sure. So for now, what I'm going to do anyway is still just use this as a pattern. Okay, so I did the bottom now. <laughs> I might have done it. Okay, so now I'm going to cut the sides. Remember, an inch bigger. About, I'm guesstimating an inch. That should be about an inch. Cut about an inch bigger. You'll know to get, like if you're using this, let's say for instance this skirt, you want to get something where you know that the fabric is has a similar stretch to it. This one, I think it does. Hold on. I'm going to pin down the sides and then figure out if I want to make it where it's elastic at the top or if I just want to go ahead and use the fabric and make a waistband that flaps over. Okay, YouTube, so I'm going to go ahead and I think I'm just going to add elastic to the top. So I'm going to go ahead and cut off about an inch off of the top and being that this is striped I shouldn't have a problem cutting in a straight line I can still use this as a waistband if I want to but I don't think I'm going to do that I have my elastic I believe this is one inch elastic let me see yeah this is one inch elastic and so for the elastic, what you're going to do is you take it, if you have the skirt already that has elastic, you can use that to um, measure your elastic. Or if not, you would wrap this around your waist and add an inch. So I already have my skirt and I can see it's over here, unstretched. See when you stretch this like that. So I can just, I have my skirt and I can see right here. So I could just um, let's take the elastic, do that, and then add about an inch to it. Cut right here. And that's going to be my elastic. So I'll come back with the next step. Okay, guys, so my next step is going to be I'm going to stitch down the sides. I was going to leave the two slits on the side, but I'm thinking I'm not going to do that. But I'm just going to go ahead and sew down both sides, and then I'll come back and show you the next Okay, step. YouTube, so I finally got to get to the sewing machine so I can show you guys. And um, what I want to let you know is um, always when you have your material, you're going to be cutting the material inside out. Standard seam allowance is 5 eighths of an inch, I believe. So you always want to put the foot down. And then you're going to be removing pins as you go along. And you always want to back stitch first. So that's what I'm going to do now. Okay. Ready. We're ready to go. Practice makes perfect. Okay, so as you're getting to the bottom, you're going to want to back stitch. Mine is going over the seam allowance. Okay, see, a back stitch. And okay, so I'm going to do the same thing to the other side and I'll come right back. Okay, YouTube, so we're done sewing both sides of the skirt. So now what we're going to do is hem. Alright, so you're going to fold to hem the bottom. You're going to take it, if you can see right here. 
You're going to fold it over once and then about a half an inch. Okay, and then you're going to fold it over another half an inch. And then you're going to take your pin. If you're a beginner, you want to pin all around. See that there, the pins? I'm pinning all the way around, and I'm going to go ahead and um, sew the hem. I took the elastic, put it on, a, took the fabric at the very edge top, and then zigzag stitched it all the way around, right? All the way around. So now I'm not done. After you do that, then, and the skirt is still inside out, you're going to take that and fold it over and then your elastic will be you'll just do a zigzag stitch all around 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 and then it should be done see this is the right side out so it's going to look like this and this is the inside out you can kind of see the stitch right there okay guys i am done with my maxi skirt and i am loving it here is the side the other side and the back yes I'm loving it don't forget to subscribe to my fashion channel charisma for you fashion and if any of you guys decide to make this skirt please send me links to the pics or to the video thank you guys so much for watching I love you all bye bye